stupid enough to not know where you're going? You are so pathetic. Poor pathetic Tabitha. No one you're such a miserable loser on the planet. Not even her own parents love her. Or anyone for that matter. <laughs> Late. Now hurry up now! Okay. Ugh, you stupid girl. I, I'm sorry. I'm Tabitha Schmidt. My life went downhill when I was 14 years old. My biological parents are not around. When I was 13, my house got broken into. I got kidnapped by random strangers and they took out my parents. My dad's in a coma. He's been in a coma for over two and a half years, but my mom unfortunately passed from blunt force trauma to the head. It really breaks my heart saying that I don't have anyone to turn to. My foster parents care very little about me and only took me in for money. At school, I have no friends. I get bullied constantly and my teacher sees me as an unworthy miscreant. Instead of helping me, they would punish me when I did nothing wrong. They don't take me seriously. All I have is myself and my counselor. Good morning, Tabitha. Hi. Are you okay? Um, no. What happened? I had a hard time sleeping with this nightmare I had. It feels like this nightmare is repeating itself over and over again. I'm fearing that it might become reality. I'm noticing that I'm barely getting any sleep anymore because of these nightmares occurring almost every night. Either it's the same thing or worse. Oh, Tabitha, dear. I'll try to talk to the higher ups about this. No matter what it takes, I want you to be strong at your very best because I believe in you. Thanks, Miss Bailey. Now you get out there and stay strong for me and yourself. You're welcome at my office anytime. My door is always open. Okay, thank you. Look, it's the loser girl. Ew, she's disgusting. <laughs> loser alert! Watch out, the loser's right there. <laughs> Look at her, she's so ugly. No wonder she has no friends. Looking at her, I feel like I want to throw up. Uh, uh, watch it! Uh, I I'm, I'm so sorry, I, I didn't... My dog? Are you that stupid? I'm I'm so sorry. I girls Let's go ladies. I cannot be late for class. And you if you slip up again like that again, you will get more than get punched on the floor. That'll teach you a lesson about messing with us. <laughs> Loser. <laughs> Oh my, are you hurt? Yes, it's my ankle and arm. Oh my goodness. Let me take you to the nurse, okay? Thank you, sir. And that's how they- Tabitha, you're late again! I'm sorry, ma'am. I, I was in the nurse's office. Enough with the excuses, Tabitha. You're getting attended for the third time. I, I really was in the nurse's office, I promise. I said enough, Tabitha! If you're late again, I will give you a week of detention and I'm going to call your parents. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. Good. Go to your seat now. I guess we're not the only ones who think she's, she's a loser. She's such a bad she's influence such a pain in her neck. Tabitha is still pathetic. Tabitha is such an embarrassment. What an embarrassing waste. I know, right? 